Yeah, you're right right now, bro. Oh, fuck, <laughs> Gotta love Let's it. Go! <laughs> no! Let's go! Let's go! Go, go, go! Turn two, turn two! Slam! Let's go! What is up, guys? Your boy Smith has back at it, and guys, we are at another Sunday League game. We are out here for game 10. Shout out Coach Kinez. Coach, you hopping in the lineup again today? Hey, I'm in the lineup. At least it's on paper right now. We'll see who shows up, but so far, I'm oh, in. Dude, guys, we're looking light today again, bro. Uncle Slam's on standby. <laughs> oh no. We got people rolling up. We got cameraman Jeremy. What's good, bro? What's good, bro? Are you ready to play, bro? Yeah, I am ready to play. It's been a while. Saucy second baseman. That's right. We got Fernando in the house. What's good, bro? The spicy mango margaritas hidden, though. Bro. I had a few margaritas last night. Feeling a little bit spicy today. I'm at first base today, so let's just hope I don't like. What the hell? You know what I mean? Yeah, went out last night with the. Got some food with Dodger Films. I didn't get no food. Yeah, you just got the Margs and a Pazuki. And a Pazuki. Beers and some tacos sound good, so let's try Mercy then. Might as well. You know what? I'd rather eat sugar and alcohol. But hey, man, he's one of the first ones here. So yeah, if you guys are new, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. We're bringing you Valley Boys game all summer. Boys, are you kidding me? Dante just said, be there soon, finishing my haircut. Bro, what? I mean, guys, we're wearing a hat today. Maybe we should just bring a barber next game. Comment down below if you're a barber. This man's getting a haircut? First he's like shopping for a car, and now he's getting a haircut. He'll do anything but come on time. We got a good squad uh, of five people, I think. <laughs> so we're waiting to see what's uh, how many more people are showing up. Yeah, like how about he comes to the Valley Boys game? Maybe that's a priority, maybe? Is he gonna wear a hat? <laughs> what does he need a haircut for? Dude, that's what I'm saying. I guess we'll get the fresh sides, like, shoot. By now, me and you both know that's just classic. Valley Boys game. All right, guys, we got the Indios rolling in. It looks like we're out matching them, even though we don't even have a full nine yet. It's looking like we're gonna have to go utility Kinez again today. I think playing second. I'm not sure. Bro. I'm about to play catch with my dad. I guess we'll figure it out. I mean, you were pretty solid last time, dude. I had to go to short last time, two games ago. Yeah. Comment down below if you guys want me to start training for the infield, because like clearly we're gonna need it. This is a A1 infield, but how's the TikTok going? Uh, I'm almost up to a thousand followers. Yeah, so I hit 80,000 on one and I thought this TikTok thing is easy. <laughs> I don't know why this kid's been doing this so long. He doesn't have a million yet. But then my next video hit 300 views, so I'm a little bit frustrated. So now I understand your son's pain. Yeah, so uh, like and subscribe, <laughs> all that stuff. At this point, I mean, like, I think we're just used to people showing up late. I'll be honest, instead of conducting interviews, it's good to kind of warm up. I don't think I've warmed up ever. Oh, true. <laughs> Me and Jeremy are always running it. That series all is up in here, baby. What's up? What's up? We're gonna take a dub today. Rocking the Valley Boys trucker. Top on valleyboys.shop. <laughs> what do you have underneath? A shirt? What do you have underneath? <laughs> uh, a sweater? <laughs> <laughs> I've decided to embrace it, uh, but seriously, Manscaped, I would be down if you wanted to sponsor. It's Steven, Steven's brother, me, and Steven's dad, coach. That's already a. That's, that's one third of the. One third of the there. team. I just need six man. other guys just to get out of bed on time. Still can't manage to pull that off. Hello. Sorry. I was at the Morgan Wallen concert last night, so that is why I'm late. I blame him. You got this headband there, too. New headband. I think it's like a firefighter support thing. It's got the red line for firefighters. You know, everyone likes firefighters. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out Velo Shades. The shots are sweet. I wear them like everywhere. Hey, code Valley Boys for 10% off, baby. Do I get my glasses, too? Your Velo Shades, bro. Well, you gotta show up to games to get them. Damn, I showed up today. I think someone stole yours, to be honest, bro. I think I might have given them to Nikki. Nikki? Yeah. Nikki, give me back my glasses. Bro, you ready to throw today? You ready to start on the mound? Yeah, I'm ready. Strikeouts. Again. Let's go. And I'm batting. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah, dude. He put on a story. Come through to watch me hit some bombs. So come support the boys. Pay attention on our socials. I'm Valley Boys LA, Steve Kinez. We repost the schedule so you guys can come to the games if you guys want. If you're in the area in the valley, you can make him stop. He's being mean and bullying. You know, last week we got in a fight because he left. Rolled the clip. Yeah, bro. Bro, you didn't even see that. Yeah, I heard about that. Don't assume like, huh? Oh. What are we doing, dog? What do you got? It happened. What the? People get upset like when they play the, the Valley Boys. I'm really total peacekeeper. <laughs> Definitely wouldn't happen if I was there. Just trying to let that happen today. I'm gonna start the fight today, actually. Does anyone want to warm up with you? I haven't asked. My plan is to warm up in the first inning. I mean, I might need it, but I'm not gonna do it. So hopefully it doesn't end up costing us. It's a dangerous game. We'll see how it goes. I just need Steven to shove so no one gets on base. If they run on me, they will be safe. Quip. <laughs> also a name name. It's from Fortnite. Actually, never mind. Sorry. I love Fortnite, though. Do you guys know Fortnite? It's the game, and you can build and stuff. Crank 90s. That's what they say. I love Fortnite. Also, that one. Um, that one. It's really, I love Fortnite. Comment if you like Fortnite. Comment if you like Fortnite right now. I saw I get shot on camera. Fernando, here's the glove you asked for. Oh, thank you. Yeah. He's oh. <laughs> a little bit shy. I am shy. Thank you. It's okay. <laughs> I like Fernando. <laughs> he walked in and I was listening to the Barbie soundtrack. 
Oh, whoa, what's up, man? When did you get here? <laughs> I wish I was lying. This is really that good? Fire, I was listening to, uh, I'm just Ken. Any Barbie fans out there, you know what I'm talking about. How do you feel about playing multiple positions today? We gotta do what we gotta do. Dude, we, got we made it, we made it. Jake rolling in, bro. Still game time. T minus 11 minutes out of bed. Which means, according to the Valley Boys, uh, you're early. <laughs> You're on time. It's looking like Jake's probably a heavy MVP favorite for the season. So uh, if anybody could show up kind of late-ish, it's uh, Jake with six home runs or something. Appreciate it. Hey, let's just get this dub. Go home. We need a mercy today like we've ever needed one. Wait, why? You have a party after or something? No, just <laughs> need to go back to bed. Probably short a little <laughs> bit on sleep. Hey, you playing today? Sign of the waiver. You playing today? Yeah, we're about to lose our first inning. Let's find the loop. You're going to be one, two, three outs on every inning. <laughs> Dude, I'm shaking. I'm nervous. <laughs> I haven't been in in like two years. Our boy's helmet's on. Dante isn't here, so Slam's hopping in. We're gonna see how it goes. I'm batting second right now, and uh, game's about to get started, baby. Let's get a cue the montage. Nikki Knox right now. Let's go, baby. Dodgers base running is crazy. <laughs> he pulled it out in a baseball game. Let's. That was so sick. It's Fernando De La Cruz right there. You know, I did the little. <laughs> yeah, I that, saw a donut at third base and I wanted it. I'm freaking hustling hard to second base and I see everybody out in the left field and I'm like, okay, I see third base. There's nobody there, not even a third base coach. By the way, where were you? So I was like, you know what? I'm taking off. Took off, got there, but I got there. <laughs> 90 feet's a long way, dude. Yeah, bro, I was running and I was like, damn, it's getting further away. How's that even possible? Dude just kept going, bro. He didn't even think twice about it. He does that a lot in Dodger films. So crazy to see him bring it to the baseball field. Then Chris Minnick rolled over a ball. They got the out at second and Chris beat it out because he's Speedy. That was just me sabotaging Thomas. I wanted him off the bases. <laughs> he got asked if he wanted a pinch runner because he's the catcher. He ended up stealing and then he asked Thomas to get a pinch runner. <laughs> Hi, boy, Minnick. We got Minnick stealing a bag. Yeah. Oh, pinch okay. runner. Boy, Minnick stealing and uh, he's pinch running. <laughs> I just knew Thomas wasn't going to take seconds. So I had to do it. Yeah, what a savage. Look at the Indio second baseman. He was all confused, bro. This man's thinking ahead. Jake, how are we doing so far, bro? Steven hit an absolute bomb of a triple. So Let's go, we're baby. feeling good. Yeah, boys, unfortunately, the cameraman was falling asleep, but I absolutely destroyed this ball almost onto the soccer courts. Ended up rounding second right here. Kind of looked like Jack Sparrow running the bases, but uh, yeah, great way to start the day. Except for the fact that it wasn't recorded. RIP. Did a little head tilt thing and I was just seeing bat to ball. Yeah, all glory to God, baby. Oh, where am I playing? You're right right now, bro. Oh, let's go, <laughs> Gotta love let's it. Let's go! <laughs> Regina's definitely gonna get some pics of uh, her bro and right. Oh, this is gonna be interesting. I didn't tell you. Boy, still no Dante. I said shout out to Dante's barber getting up here on a Sunday at 8 a.m. <laughs> yeah, you gotta awesome. love the dedication <laughs> to the crop. <laughs> Freaking kids getting that fresh cut. Dude, I guess the cut's more important. Gosh. All right, now we got I'm Uncle Slam. Let's see you, Slammer. Slam's debut. Debut. <laughs> Gene. With absolute ice in his veins, Uncle Slam put his best swing on a ball and it ended up dropping for a base hit. And we were all stoked. Oh my Come god, on, baby, get down. Get down. Let's go! I wasn't expecting it. I was just pretty much thinking, like, please just make contact. Our boy Slam! I mean, this is my first competitive at bat in two years. It was weird, honestly. <laughs> him just being at the plate, I'm like, what is this? Dad's finally gonna be proud of him. I'm just so thankful that my sister finally understands that I got potential. <laughs> Mr. Don. 
Dante shows up. Yo, listen, I gotta I had to get the haircut. Dude, oh, got Slam's hitting for you right now, bro. Yeah. You're in the hole. You're in the hole. Oh, shit. I was uh I was getting a haircut. My barber took a little minute. I had my appointment at eight o'clock. I got there about eight twenty-five. So you were late to your barber too? Yeah. I mean, he does have the fresh cut though. Just had Devon, my barber. Devon's working, bro. At eight a.m. on a Sunday or what? Yeah, I had to bring him flowers and a plant for him to cut my hair Dude. on a Sunday. <laughs> Why not just after the game though? Because he's going to water park with his kids. <laughs> now we know. He hid for his tickets. <laughs> yeah. Dante needed a hit before we flipped the lineup, and he didn't even have his jersey done or his belt on. They're like, oh, you're in the hole. I'm like, what? I just butt in the pants, no jersey tucked in. I waddle out to home plate. I don't even have time to put on the batting gloves. But that didn't matter because he turned around the first pitch he saw into a base hit in the center field as he waddled to first base. I don't even have the belt on. The <laughs> tarp untucked. I just grabbed the bat, first pitch, boom. Single up the middle. I'm still getting dressed, man. We're in the game. No stretching, no warm up. I just do it. Then, guys, the cameraman <laughs> was not filming my at bat, and I hit an absolute bomb. I hit it out of the stadium, but I hit the top of the fence, so they made me think it was a ground rule double. Yeah, the left fielder straight up lied to the umpire, and I had my head down, so I didn't even know. They also had a bet with Dante that he needed to steal the base and they would buy him alcohol. So, yeah, they told me it was a ground rule double, and I just stayed at second. Here's Dante's interview for more context. I got on first base. Their whole infield looks at me, and they're like, hey, steal the base. I'm like, what? We're up. By a bunch of runs so i'm like i'm not i'm not even gonna take a lead and they're like steal the base we want to test our catcher's arm and then the shortstop looks at me he's like i'll buy you a beer next game if you steal the base i'm like yes i'm i'm definitely gonna steal this base now i go i'm stealing all i hear is dink i look up i'm like there's no way this dude hit the ball right now while i'm stealing about to get my free beer i see it drop and i'm like damn i gotta run run now yeah i hit the ball i hit the ball over the fence i'm just kind of annoyed at a the umpire two dante and three the other team for not being honest with it but uh yeah man whatever thankfully it went over the fence so i didn't have to i could just jogged a third i got a one game beef with steven because i missed out on a free beer and stolen base yeah, i got a one day beef with dante for stealing my camera man nobody wants to see your steal bro i paid him there to see my bomb man but i didn't even get it yeah then my brother nikki got absolutely plunked he's been getting hit a lot recently so that got the dugout fired up Attaboy, oh, Nikki. he's rubbing it i got another dose this is bad it's becoming like my thing to get dosed i'm not a fan of it let out an audible sigh as soon as he got hit by the ball. Bro, Nikki gets welts every game. He gets dosed like all the time. Well, he knew what was happening. He was <laughs> yeah. so disappointed. Nikki's a ball magnet, bro. I'm about to hit for the cycle, and I don't mean like the actual cycle. I mean strike up, pop up, line out, and uh, ground out. So let's Okay, go. ball and play, bro. You rocking the fresh Bruce Bolts? Yes, sir. Shout out Bruce Bolt. You know, use code Kinez for uh, your uh, discount. Let's so, go, yeah. man. Use code Kinez. Get yourself some fire Bruce Bolts. I might need some. Yeah. Oh! That head first slide, I put it all on the line for the team, but between me and you, I was just falling and I made it look like a slide. I wasn't struggling, right? I was just making sure later in my later at bats that they gave me a pitch, first pitch right down the middle, which they ended up doing. And you know, I roped like a little fair ball that was maybe a couple inches outside of the line, but we're not gonna tell the umpire that. <laughs> Guys, in the top of the ninth, I was four for five. The home run to go for the cycle, even though I technically already hit a home run. So this would have actually needed to just be a double. And look, I absolutely barreled this ball into the sky. I thought it was an easy fly out, but the ball just kept on carrying. I was kind of jogging out of the box and then I absolutely turned on the jets. And us not having a third base coach, I peeped the ball coming in through the cutoff. The ball was already rolling into shortstop, but all I heard was my dugout saying, keep going. Then I did a little weird spin move, booked it to home and did not make it in time. It was pretty embarrassing and got like 100,000 views.
views on TikTok and Instagram and uh, a lot of hate comments saying I should have hustled him. Look, guys, I agree. With no third base coach, I don't know if any of you guys are running with a ball already rolling onto shortstop. And it happened to be the most accurate throw ever got thrown out from center field. Steven, what happened, bro? Oh, I'm trying to third base coach, bro. Inches from the cycle. Should have pulled it, Fernando. Yeah, RIP, bro. I was so close, bro. Somehow got thrown out from center field with a no cut. Everybody just got out of the way. I ran out of steam, though, I'm be honest. Man. Should have been like me, bro. Just don't stop running. I, yeah, I know. <laughs> You hate to see it. That's why you always run hard no matter what. You never know what's gonna happen on the field. I was trying to hit for the cycle today, the out cycle. I was trying to hit a ground ball, pop up, line out, and strike out. And I got most of them. Boys, I would have been this cycle. I know, I, should, I shouldn't have paused at third, but guys, let me be honest with you. If I see a ball coming into shortstop, I don't pause to look, I'm just like insane. But to be successful, you gotta be kind of insane, so. Ah, dang. Should have went for it. I'll go for it next time. To close out the ninth, Thomas Keller went back out there to shut it down for the Valley Boys. Tested out his lob ball and got a strikeout. Then got a swinging bunt where they told him to let it go because they wanted to keep hitting. And uh, ended up scooping it for the last out. And the Valley Boys get the dub 10 to 1. And I ended up going 5 for 6 on the day. Regina, your brother went off. What are your thoughts? Honestly, I'm shocked. I don't. <laughs> I did not see that coming. I was just going to strike out. I mean, it was good, but I thought it would be so bad. Uncle Slam first game pulled up and he showed up. What, he got a double and a single? Dodger Films legend out here now. Valley Boys legend. Honestly, that kid has heart. You know, it was his first game with a busted ass knee. Uncle Creamy brought the sauce. It's so weird because I'm the golden child and today, like, I feel like I got kicked off of that spot. I was shaking in my boots. This guy was out here chucking, I think, what is that, like 95 out there? <laughs> I've seen 90 before. That was, that was close. Anybody want a glizz? <laughs> Alright, I gotta head out. <laughs> Alright guys, that is gonna be that in the video today. Woo! Got that dope. And the MVP is Steven and Uncle Chris. Let's go, oh! baby! Uncle Slam with a couple knives. Let's yes, go, sir. Baby. The leg brace came on and the beast came out. <laughs> oh, Guys, I am so pleasantly surprised with Slam. Like usual, we were looking like Slam's been begging me for an at bat, and I was like, you know what? Before we hit the playoffs, I got an extra jersey in my car. Slam, you might have to come in today. Dante wasn't here and he stepped up, bro. Played right field for a half inning. The man had a double and a single, bro. Let's freaking go, Slam. Oh, sh I gotta do the interview, bro. I was heading to the ER right now, bro. Was it worth it? To play with the Valley Boys? Yeah. To yeah. play with the Valley Boys? Dude, it's been an honor, bro. I've been behind the camera the whole time, and i just been dreaming about it. You guys want a piece of my hot dog? Just drop a get well soon to slam in the comments. Yes, sir. Almost hit for the cycle, but failed at the end. But, you know, winning effort for the team one. Let's go, baby. Yeah, I'll have to go for Steven. Yeah, guys, I made some adjustments. You know, I've been hitting all week, and I've seen the ball today. What was up with the home I run? I just ran out of steam, bro. I'll be honest with you. I hit a triple, but me, right? <laughs> oh, yo, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, guys, that's going to be the end of the video today. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, join the boys. Follow us on Instagram. Make sure you guys subscribe. Yeah, that's going to be the end of the video today. See you guys in the next one. Peace. Uncle Slam in the weight room, bro. Bro, I'm out here working at the airport, bro. Trying yeah. to get my money up and my silly down, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. I'm trying to use my money up, not my funny up, my silly down.